we've come to Holland Park in London. Gardener Steve Redman is going to show us how to lift and divide herbaceous perennials. Herbaceous plants are soft stemmed and the term perennial refers to plants that can survive frost and stay in the ground all year round. They may appear to die during the winter but the rootstock will survive to protect the following year's shoots. Dividing creates several individual plants from a single original one and should be carried out every two to three years to keep the plants healthy. It can be done at any time of the year but for best results divide summer flowering plants in autumn or spring and spring flowering plants in summer just after flowering. Steve is going to divide Jerusalem sage. Step 1. You will need a spade, two garden forks, a watering can with rose attachment and a pair of secateurs. Step 2. Lift. Gently lift plants out of the soil with a spade working away from the crown centre to limit root damage. Step 3. Divide. Small plants can be pulled apart with your hands. Larger perennials will need to be divided by inserting two garden forks into the crown of the plant back to back, delivering the forks away from each other to loosen the root mass. If the plant has a fleshy root, it may need to be cut apart with a spade or a knife. The original plant should be divided into clumps containing three to five shoots. Step four, prune. Trim larger, older leaves with secateurs and remove the dead foliage. Step five, replant. The divided plant should be replanted as soon as possible. Turn the soil over with a garden fork and create holes for the plants in the loosened soil. Steve doesn't recommend adding fertiliser as herbaceous perennials are fast growing, but if you are replanting into the same site, you may want to add a handful of slow release fertiliser as the soil may be low in nutrients. Position the plants about 30 centimetres apart so they have space to grow. Water thoroughly after planting. Done. 